It is 6.05 right now, day two of the Democratic National Convention in Philadelphia. Let's take a look at what is happening today. There will be the official roll call of states. Today's theme is a lifetime of fighting for children and families. President Bill Clinton will headline tonight's program. And last night, Bernie Sanders tried to rally his supporters around the Democratic ticket. First Lady Michelle Obama and Senator Elizabeth Warren added their voices as well. Based on her ideas and her leadership, Hillary Clinton must become the next president of the United States. When I think about the kind of president that I want for my girls and all our children, that's what I want. Let's face it, Donald Trump has no real plans. No plans to make anything great for anyone except rich guys like Donald Trump. One of the people watching this process up close calls San Antonio home. Former State Senator Letitia Vandepew was also on stage. Steve Spreester keeping a close eye on all the latest developments from Philadelphia. I'm frightened that when I get up there uh, that I will be overwhelmed. The center stage spotlight on a front row witness to history and the back and forth between the Sanders and Clinton camps. What are you going to be thinking when you're up there on stage? That I'm a little bit of this history being made and hopeful that uh, my mom's watching, who's 83, and hopeful that my four-year-old granddaughter is watching as well. The San Antonio's Letitia Vandepute is co-chair of the DNC Rules Committee. This, her big night. She was appointed by soon-to-be former DNC chair Debbie Wasserman Schultz. The DNC email leak tainting the start of this convention. When something goes terribly wrong, and those emails were terribly wrong, you need to step down, and she is, because the focus needs to be on electing the next president. Vandepute's first Democratic convention was in 1988. She calls this one with a female nominee the most historic. When I see uh, you know, Secretary Clinton and uh, Senator you know, Kane, what a qualified, wonderful team uh, to move this country forward. She says each convention has its own feel, and few are without their bumps and bruises. We will come together very quickly. Today's featured speaker is former President Bill Clinton trying to get people to back his wife. In Philadelphia for GMSA, Steve Spreister, KSAT 12 News. Hi, Steve. He and a digital reporter Ryan Lloyd and photojournalist Dale Keller staying on the political beat all week from Philly. You can find all their stories on KSAT.com and on the KSAT app.